hello assalamu alaikum i hope you all uh, you are doing well uh, in this tutorial we are going to design equivalent circuit model of uh, this fss which is uh, a unit cell and it is uh, resonating at uh, 28 gigahertz so here you can see uh, s1 is above minus 5 db while s21 is uh, resonating at 28 gigahertz Similarly, S12 is also at uh, 28 GHz and uh, S22 is above minus 5 dB. The design structure of this equivalent circuit model you can see is like this. And uh, we will try in ADS to design equivalent circuit model of this unit cell. So let comes to ADS. Here you can see I have already designed an equivalent circuit model for um, for the purpose for this for this uh, structure so this is a capacitor and uh, its value is 0 0.095 picofarad while these three inductors are connected with each other in series and its values are 0 0.055 nano henry while this capacitor is representing the adjacent capacitance between two uh, adjacent units cell. So here its value is uh, 0 0.095 picofarad, and uh, this one, this port is uh, representing uh, the front. Uh, you can see, you can say this one. This is first port, and this is second port, which is behind the unit cell so these two spores are representing um, these uh, this is this is representing let let's suppose this is representing port 1 and this is representing port 2 and i have already shown to you these two ports are um, working with the this unit cell so now let's come to you this uh, equivalent circuit model of um, unit cell which is actually a FSS frequency selective surface so while the starting frequency and stopping frequency is shown over here starting frequency is 0 hertz while the stopping frequency is uh, 50 gigahertz so and uh, the number of points is 100 you can change it from from this places from here and here while number of points you can also change from this point and by applying and pressing ok you can um, change that ok this is option of simulation but before uh, that I want to uh, show you how you can design this equivalent circuit model so let I have delete these two um, wires and I have selected this capacitor from this window you can see ok this um, capacitor is showing horizontal while I have used this as a vertical so for that you can rotate it you will right click and then you will rotate R so this will rotate according to your uh, need you can change its value to 0. Point, uh, 0. 0.0 5 pico per hour. Okay, you can copy it by by pressing Control C and by pressing V you can place it where you want. So I have already a capacitor over here. So just I need to connect it with my circuit. This line. Okay. Similarly, I will also connect it over here ok uh, now this is our three inductors L1 uh, sorry L3 L6 and uh, L7 you can also rename it as L1 L2 and uh, L3 Okay, and now 
let's come to this source so you can select it by pressing this option and by dragging you can see these options are these force are uh, here so I have already these force so now I am deleting it by pressing delete similarly this will also really ok this parameter you can select this parameter from this option and you can see I have already uh, selected it but you can do it so here the starting and stopping frequency is 1 and 10 you can change it manually to 50 hertz 50 gigahertz and so you can also change it from this fan and number of points you can also change up to 100 so by pressing apply ok you can undo it so I think I have already selected it over here so I doesn't need it so now now I think I should sim uh, I need to simulate this antenna so here by pressing that you can see uh, S11 is almost about to you can see this is at 28 gigahertz S11 is above minus 5 dB and similarly S22 is also here and uh, let's see S21 and S11 so S12 is all is also simulating at 28.2 gigahertz and similarly S21 is also uh, resonating at 28.2 gigahertz okay how you can draw this graph so for that you will uh, first of all you will need a free space and then you will come to this this option and then you will place it by pressing ok so I need S12 and uh, I will add it similarly the, the scale of the uh, S11 is in dB and S2, S12 is also in dB so I will just add it and by pressing ok it will add it over here by pressing ok you can see S11 and S21 is shown over here ok you can also um, you can also check uh, in phase reflection so in phase reflection of 180 degree so for that you will need to again uh, select another window and then you can uh, check S in phase reflection of uh, S11 so you will just need to add it and then you will uh, need to click on page and by pressing ok you can see here um, in page reflection is shown over here you can also add S12 and S21 over here by pressing by pressing add by clicking add and it's where it's in the DB and by pressing ok you can see S11 S12 is shown over here but I think uh, uh, this is not the uh, right way of representation of this super so let's I'm deleting it and uh, this graph is actually the right representation of S11 and uh, S12 so if you want to delete S S21 so you just you need to click on it and uh, then delete it and press ok so here you can see ok now let's come to the magnitude manage sorry um, scaling option I'm looking for scaling option but I think for now it's enough take care and see you soon bye bye